Hello everybody, welcome back to Valvetronic Designs. Today we'll be showing you how to install our F chassis axle back rear section to an F chassis BMW. This specifically is a 2016 340i, so the same process will be used for the M240, the 440, and a similar process for any other F chassis BMW. This vehicle is currently equipped with a CTS free flow downpipe and a single mid pipe from Dynan. Overall, the installation process of the axle back is very simple. We recommend for B58 applications for you to partner with a local exhaust shop. And what they'll do is they'll cut the mid pipe and weld in an adapter piece so that the axle back fits perfectly. For this application with the dining mid pipe, we cut a few inches off and got the adapter piece welded in so it slips onto the rear section very easily. For four cylinder applications, we included an adapter pipe uh, for the four cylinder mid pipe to the axle back which you would have the same process of going to an exhaust shop, getting it welded in so the fitment is just right. The first step for this installation is to remove the factory rear section or aftermarket rear section that you have already. You can either cut it or unbolt it depending on your mid pipe setup. Uh, once that space is cleared, you are ready to start swapping over the factory parts. So here we swapped over the factory hangers and bolted them on to the rear section as well as swap the factory motor over here. As you might see, it is on the opposite side. Uh, we include a harness for you so that it extends the valve to be on the passenger side of the vehicle. The factory valve harness is located here on the passenger side of the vehicle. We include an extension harness that plugs right into your factory. You can easily route it behind the heat shield and the plug is right here for the relocated valve. Now that you have all of the hardware swapped over, it's time to install the exhaust to the mid pipe. So first we're going to lift up the axle back and put it onto the adapter that we have welded in. Beautiful. And then all you're going to do is bolt up the hangers that you have swapped over. Once the axle back is all installed, you're ready to plug in your provided harness, which goes right in to the factory valve. Once the wire is plugged in and it's all hidden away so it's not touching anything hot, you can install the tips. We have them mounted up here. It's very simple. All you do is slip them on to the length in which is desired and then tighten them down and you're all set. You have a new F chassis rear section open and close the valve to make your car loud or quiet with the touch of a button. The valve actuator itself, the function of it varies between model to model. We recommend using the Bimmerlink app to connect via OBE and then open and close the valves manually. Uh, depending on what tune you have, like if you have boot mod, you can program the valves to then open in sport mode and be completely closed in comfort mode. It all depends on what you're looking for. Following uh, immediate install, the valve will follow the factory valve behavior. 